Welcome to Epo Fitness, our online studio for today's strength and agility session. So you need a set of dumbbells, the heavier the better, water and a towel and positive mindset and lots of energy. So, uh, five exercises, one minute each, three rounds sandwiched between a mobility session and a cool down. We're going to start standing up, we're going to slowly progress via mobility session into that tough uh, metabolic workout, but to begin with, nice and straight. So let's get you up uh, right at the top end of your mat so your mat is nice and lengthened in front of you. And the first thing I want you to do is simply lift your arms up to the ceiling, lift up and feel how that back opens up, arms reach, grab a hold with one arm to the other, and just lean back slightly, keeping the core tight. Your arms open and then you gently bring your chin down and then vertebra by vertebra roll down all the way towards the floor, extending, stepping out all the way forward. You're going to set your shoulders back as a nice way to prime that upper back and then you bring your head down and walk your palms back to the starting position. Now as your arms go back, try keeping your legs absolutely straight and once you return, soften your knees and start to articulate back up to the top straightly, opening your shoulders back and down, lifting your arms up above your chest, leaning back ever so slightly with your arms above your head and then open them and let's go bringing your head back down, you roll down to the bottom. As we progress through these mobility exercises, make sure just to listen to your body, see how it feels today, I'm going to build it up. Again, walking back up to the starting position, slowly softening your knees, rolling up, lifting, lifting, lifting. Before you come back down, let's do one squat. So you're going to keep your body nice and tall, nice and upright. Drop your butt down to the ground, try not to round your body, and then a little bit more explosively, exhale to the top, and then you're going to roll down to the bottom. You're going to touch that floor, you're going to walk out. As you walk out into that standing position, you're going to place one palm to the opposite shoulder, just a mini tap, bring the palm down, another mini tap, put the palm down and walk back in. So just layering a little bit of complexity onto your movements, knees soften and then slowly, slowly roll back up. Lift the arms, still working on that upper back extension, a very subtle lean, but make sure your stomach is tight. Arms open, let's do two squats. Each one, you come up on the tip of the toes when you lift. So up on the tip of the toes, get those calves to switch on, inhale down. Then again, explosive up on the tip of the toes, and then back down. All right, from there, again, roll down, vertebra by vertebra. Extend, walk. From there, nice and simple, with your palms directly underneath your shoulders, not too dissimilar to downward dog, you're gonna push back but then you're going to reach one arm to the opposite knee, little tap, creating that rotation through the body, return, we'll come back to this movement later, and then again to the other side, touch, return, and then a little tap, one shoulder like you did before down, and the other shoulder like you did before, back down, this time I want you to walk your feet towards your palms, tip it toe yourself all the way in, all the way in and in, in until the palms, feet right next to your palms, soften those knees and gently roll up, 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 reach, arms up, gentle lean, and then five squats, raising up on the tip of the toe. So, inhale, try to keep your feet wide, knees 45 degrees out, feet 45 degrees out. And as you drop, let's use this as a stretch. So you get your butt right down to the ground, and you'll feel the stretch. Of course, you're working your strength on the way up, but on the way down, your lower back is being challenged, your inner thighs are being challenged. Let's go one more time. Inhale, exhale, drive. And then roll your head down. Let's continue with that mobilization. Palms down on the floor. Walk, walk, walk. Extend. Put those knees down. Put your knees down. Easy five Superman exercises. One arm opposite leg extend. Reach them. Don't just straighten. Reach as if you try to touch one ball with your fingertips, the other ball with your heel, and then bring the elbow up against the knee. Four more. Extend. Bring it down. Bring it down. Bring it down. Extend. Let's go all the way down. Two more. Reach up. Down. One more. Reach, reach, reach. 
Bring it down, down, down. Fantastic. Swap. Same on the other side. Extension as you reach your arm and leg away from one another. Flexion as you bring the elbow up against the knee. Start tuning in to your breath. Make sure that your breath doesn't get too erratic throughout the session. It will, but make sure you get plenty of time to catch your breath and only slow movement. Work with your breath. Let's go one more time. You're going to reach, 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 and then place the palm and knee down. A little bit of thoracic rotation. You're going to place the fingertips of the opposite palm, like so, apply your temples, and then elbow touches the opposite wrist, and then you open out to the side. Elbow, opposite wrist, open. Three more times, steady. Nice and standard warm up, getting everything going rotation, flexion, extension, articulation. Let's go one more time here. Elbow to the wrist, open, bring it down. Let's go to the other side. Elbow, wrist, open one. Elbow, wrist, and two. Keep your core engaged throughout the movement. Three down, two to go. Down, 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 up, one to go, down, 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 all the way up to the top, and then you're going to place your palms down, you're going to extend, you're going to place your arms slightly ahead of you, forehead down, elbows ahead of your head, and then exhale, lift the very shallow raise from your upper body, inhale, come down, one, two, exhale, raise up, one, two, then again, inhale, down, one, two, Exhale, raise, make sure your butt is nice and tight. Two more times, inhale. Exhale, as you lift, one more time, inhale. And exhale, back up, back up, back up to the top. And then gently lower yourself down. Palms right underneath your shoulders. Fold your feet under, come back up onto all fours. All right, almost there, one palm directly next to your foot. Sorry, foot directly next to your palm, just on the outside of your palms. Lift your back leg straight, creating that nice deep lunge. And then open one arm towards, towards the front knee. On the way back, place the elbow down next to the foot. And then back up to the top. And then again, elbow down next to the foot. Let's go another three times. The lower you can get that elbow, the better. So let's get it all the way down. All the way up. Two more. All the way down. And all the way up, one more time, bring it down, hold it, five, four, three, two, one, come on to the palms of your hands, that front foot steps back, your other leg steps forward, keep that nice deep lunge, and from there, you're going to use the other arm to reach, 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 and then bring it down, low as you can, up, and then down for two. When you lift up to the top, try to stack your palms one on top of the other. So nice and straight. All right, two more times. Up, bring it down. One more time. Up, up, up. Bring it down, down, down. Hold it. Five, four, three, two. Up onto the palms of your hands. You're going to place your feet back. And as the first movement, it's not part of the full circuit, but there's a nice little pulse raiser. Let's set your shoulders back, bring one knee in, and let's go steady, 45 seconds of mountain climbers. You are good to go. Keep it soft. You can vary this movement. You can just alternate one leg after another. The faster you alternate, the higher the high your heart rate. Or you can create a bit of a hop from one to the other, and that allows for a little bit more muscle work, a little bit more core work, and this is what you're maintaining for over the next 30 seconds. Let's go team. So, either running or alternating. Alternating, maybe your feet, joints are a little bit kind of not stable, then you alternate. Otherwise, nice and fast run. Another 15 seconds to go. Can you pick up that pace? Let's go. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, Three, two, one, and feet together. Walk your palms back to exactly where you started, and then we're good to begin the first exercise. Everyone's familiar jumping jacks, guys. Now that we start, we do not stop for the next 15 minutes. Five exercises, one minute each, three rounds, jumping jacks. Three, two, nice and comfortable. Feet together, arms out. 
So the first movement, or even the first round, is just to check how your body feels today. Work through each exercise, just noting, like doing a little check from feet to toes, from head to toes, to check what's aching, what's not aching, what can you push, what can't you push. The second round will be where you're really starting to push yourself. In fact, the second round is 100% effort. By the time the third round rolls on, you should be working at your peak capacity. Obviously taking care, being aware, but the third round is where we really push it. All right, and we take about five to 10 seconds in between each exercise, no rest between rounds. 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. All right, from there, feet wide. Exercise number two, legs pretty wide on this one. You're gonna roll down, touch the floor with your legs wide, walk out until you're nice and straight, and you're gonna do six push-ups. You're gonna do it this way, drop, and as you press, you touch one knee with the opposite arm, drop, let's go. Then the other knee with the opposite arm as you come out of the push-up, touch, down. I want you to count at your own pace. Once you've done six push-ups, you're going to come back up to the top, and you're going to walk your arms in, standing straight for five side lunges. You're going to drop to one side, nice and low, straighten, then the other side. Sorry, six side lunges. One side, press the other side. Press, super comfortable. One side, the other side. As soon as you've done six, you're going to repeat this one more time. And let's try and fit two rounds per minute. So pretty strong work. So you're going to roll down, let's go. And press. Tap, you can do quarter push-ups, half push-ups, attempt. Keep going. And by the way, if you haven't had the time to do full two rounds per minute, no big deal. Just moving on to the next exercise. Let's go. All right, once you've done six, walk back in. All the way in, in, in. From there, standing tall, high knees. Let's go. One knee up, and let's go. One, two, three, four. For the next 60 seconds, it's not just about how high you lift the knees, at your basic, I want you to keep moving. Absolutely no reason why you would stop in the third minute. So keep that movement high. To make this more of an abdominal exercise, keep your chest upright. With the chest upright, you're almost sitting. Your shoulders on your butt, with your chest nice and high. Using not just your hips, but also your abs to keep that movement going. Let's go. One, two, one, two. Super steady. On right, two more movements. And 20 seconds until the next one. Let's go. Can you pick up the pace a little bit? Powerful lift all the way to the top. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Back into the white stance. You're going to drop your knees nice and wide. Like that, first 30 seconds, just one leg. Lift, drop, lift, drop. Stay on one foot, you take a wide squat and then push away from that foot. 30 seconds, one side, 30 seconds, the other side. Guys, good strong work. 15 seconds on this side. You drop, essentially keeping one leg on load. Your arms moving like they're running. We're going to switch your legs in five, drop, four, drop, three, two, one. Get into the deep squat like before and then up to the side. It's like you're pushing off the side of the floor to lift the knee back up. Keep it steady. One more exercise to finish this first round. For the last exercise, you'll need your dumbbells. At least five kgs if you have, or a couple of heavy books, whatever you have, grab your cap. All right, 10, nine, eight, seven, six, 
five, four, three, two, one. Grab your dumbbells, and then with the dumbbells in your arms, you are holding a squat like this, chest up, so nobody's rounding their backs. Chest up, one leg back row, return. Leg back, return. So your spine, while being slightly, well, it's leaning about 45 degrees, but it's not collapsing. Keep your neck long, an occasional glance to your screens, but let's try not to keep your head turned for two more. Rather than doing a tricep extension, we're doing a row. Exhale, pull back. So when you start, arms in front of you, 30 seconds. Inhale, exhale. Your breathing could switch the other way as long as you're not holding your breath. Can we sit lower? Another 20 seconds. Should take you no time to put the dumbbells down and get back into jumping jacks for the second full on round. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Perfect. Dumbbells down. We start with three, two, one. Let's go. So this time around, stay light on your feet and think can you actually go faster? It's not about letting your body drop. When you want to go faster, it's about pushing the feet in and out at a faster pace. And that depends not on gravity, but your willingness to do it. Let the brain do the speed. <clears throat> Alright guys, we're on the roll. This is the round I really want you to put some effort in. In fact, I want you to see how hard can you work so that the next round feels Awfully hard. Let's go. 25 seconds. One, two, one, two. Remember the next exercise you will have wide stride. Roll down for six push-ups with a reach and then come up for six side bunches. We go for five, four, three, two, one. Guys, wide side, uh, wide uh, stance. Roll down. Move forward, push up one, touch, come back six times, push up two, touch, push up three, quarter push up also counts, four, down, five, down, six, and then you walk up, straight line, side press. Literally just shoot your butt to one side, you extend one leg while sitting on the other. And Three, four, five, six, fantastic. Roll down, one more round. Drop, tap one, drop, tap two, drop, tap three, or your own pace, maybe you do four, not six. All right, one more time for the press. Walk your arms towards your feet. Keep the stance wide, six side lunges, press, drop, press. Remember agility is the name of the game, we want to keep the body moving deep into the joints, controlling all the way back up. Alright, one more time, as soon as you finish your last lunge, feet together, knees up, let's go. One, two, one, two. Just like with the jumping jacks, work on the height of those knees. Knee the knees up. See the knees up. Let's go, guys. Make your knees all the way up. There we go. All right, guys. So here we have 30 seconds. Solid 30 seconds of work. The next exercise kind of builds on this with the cardio. It's a cardio kind of day. First, 15 seconds. Stay strong, stay light. Eight, seven, six, five, four, stay on line. Number one, stay on line, don't go anywhere. All right, white stance. Squat, hold it, pick the leg. You wanna stay on, 30 seconds. One, squat, two. It's like you're running with it. Keep it steady, keep it light. 
Drop lower if your body allows it. Lift, drop, lift, drop. As you lift one leg, the opposite arm comes up. 10 seconds before you switch. All right, we're switching. Three, two, one, up, drop, let's go the other way. If you're getting a stitch, don't worry about it. So do I, let's go, steady. One, two, drop, three, power up. Make sure you're driving that leg to the top. 20 seconds. Remember your dumbbells for the next one. Power, drop, power, drop, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one more lift. Grab your dumbbells, holding that squat with the body leaning forward ever so slightly. Let's go, three, two, chest up. And as you step one leg, go. Don't leave them waiting for me, just go for it. 60 seconds. And then good news, we've got one more round. By the way, just from the side, keep your back straight, none of this. Straight back, stick your butts out and keep moving. Row and row. That's it. Simply step your feet together, then one leg goes back. Together, one leg goes back. 30 seconds. All right, you know what's next. Next is five exercises. One minute each. Last round. Power round. If you feel you're going slow, but you want to go faster, that's no big deal. As long as your head working 100%. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, team. One more step. Dumbbells down. Each exercise you do now is the last time you do it today. So effort, effort, guys. Let's go. One, two, three, four. 60 seconds. Need to slow down. Need to recover. Slow down. Don't just stop. All right, guys. Lovely. I have a little screen here. I can see all of you pushing it. Love the work. Let's go, Annie. Alexander, superb. Now, by the way. All right. 30 seconds. Okay, this is where, like, the last round. Twice as fast. Your shoulders warmed up, legs warmed up, 20 seconds, push, literally you're pushing away from the floor and then back into the floor, last, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, wide stance, roll down, 6 push ups with a little tap, Remember, quarter push ups also count. And one, drop. Two, drop. Three, down. Four, two more times. Just keep that movement going. Butt up, butt horizontal. Butt up, butt horizontal. Walk in, straighten. And here, toes 45 degrees. Six, drop. One. Again, you may be going fast, or you may be going slower than me. That's kind of secondary to the idea of just moving. Don't stop. You finally want to the next movement, you move on. On average, it will all be the same. Let's go. Drop, lift up, roll down, set of push ups, set of side lunges. Press one. Drop. So if you get comfortable, you almost bounce on that push-up. Three, four, and five, six, and then walk yourself to your feet. Six, side lunges, then high knees. The horrible high knees, let's go. Remember, it's not your knees going forward. You shoot your bum behind you into the back wall. That makes sure that your butt is above the ankle. One more time, drop, lift, here we go. Legs up, three, two, one, go. If you need to, you're here, one, two, one, two, you don't stop. 
If you can, you run. All right, set the rhythm. Your arms actually help, so don't let them flop. Let's go off leg. Breathing steady. Keep that going. Literally less than three minutes of suffering. I mean, it's not suffering. You enjoy the suffering. No, you're laughing. What else would you be doing? I'm not sleeping. Let's go. So, 30 seconds, 25 minutes. Knees higher. Core tight, shoulders back. Alternate your knees if you need to. 15 seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5. Knees up, knees up. 4, 3, 2, 1. Light stance. Ah, don't stop. Not fast, not fast. Slower, wide knees. Up, squat. Up, squat down. As you drop, get into a deep, deep squat, then drive. Squat, it's not as squat as you would with weights, but you get into that athletic stance before you drive up. 15 seconds. Inhale, exhale, inhale. Exhale. 10, 9, 8. Remember you power through your stomach. One more time, drop the other leg. Let's go. Up, drop, up, drop. Can you pick it up? Of course you can. It's rhetorical. Let's go. Pick it up. One, two. Last round, finishing strong. The next exercise will be a little bit slower. Look at it as a little cool down. 15 seconds, back straight, arms moving, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, yes, 5, let's go, 4, 3, 2, 1, dumbbells in your arms, alright, chest up, shoulders set, sit, and bring your backs absolutely straight, step back, extend, row, Extend, breathe, return, breathe, return. Here we go, team. This is the last minute, our third round, fifth exercise, 15th set. Happy days. Exhale. Imagine you're trying to use the dumbbells to pull the belly button up as high towards your lower back as you can. So keep it strong. Keep it steady with your core as much as with your arms. 30 seconds to go. Exhale. When you row, your chest is locked over your toes. You're not shifting the weight away from the foot. 20 seconds. All right, let's pick it up. One, step. Two, step. Three, four. Last 10 seconds for the day. And eight, seven, six, five, go. Four. Three, two, one more, and step up. Lovely work. All right, quick gulp of water. If you like that sort of thing, wipe down. Let's uh, re-mobilize. Literally one, two minutes. As we cool down, we're gonna start exactly like before. Start standing at the top of your mat. Let's go arms to the sky. Breathe in and open those arms. Exhale, roll down slowly. Roll forward. That's it, man. Set your shoulders. Now your feet walking. Feet in and in, in. All the way, all the way. Soften those knees. Roll up. Reach those arms up above you. Open the arms back down. Roll down to the floor. Walking feet all the way back, set your shoulders, bring the knees down, all the fours, just let's get that rotation back in action to cool down, fingertips of one arm by your temples, five times down, open, open, open to the top, again, elbow down, open, open to the top, touching that elbow, connect to the wrist, and then up, down, 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 all the way up. Make sure you've done five repetitions before you switch to the other side. Let's go. Fingertips by one. 
The other tempo, elbow to the wrist and open. Elbow to the wrist, open, open, open. Three more, down and lift. Two more, down. Lift one more time, all the way down. All the way up to the top, placing those palms down. Let's walk your palms towards your knees like you're sitting on the tip of the toes. And then from there, just separate your feet like you're holding a sumo squat. So nice and wide. Grab the fingertips underneath your toes. Sit your chest up, neck low, butt down. Set your shoulders, take a deep breath. Exhale, head down, lift up your bum. Feel the stretch through the hamstrings. Try to relax your neck. Inhale, sitting low, chest up, chest up, chest up. Exhale, head down, lift, lift, lift. One more time, inhale, chest up, chest up, chest up. Take a seat there, arms let go of your toes, elbows push into the knees with a little shift. Side to side for three, two, and then press your feet into the ground, straighten your body, or straighten your legs, shuffle your feet together. Drop your body, bend the knees, little shifting of your head, turning of your head side to side. Three, Two, back to the middle of one, bend the knees, take a deep breath and exhale, be stack, straighten, push, shoulders back and down, lengthen, reach those arms up to the top, take a deep breath, exhale, drop them, have a fantastic, amazing day, thank you for joining me today, always a pleasure to see you, and I will see you again soon here at Evo Fitness Online Studio.